Uh, guys, um, yeah, we're about to shake the new car, the second car, right after we pick up the R8. This video today is another car that's joining the London garage. You ready? Hello, welcome back to the video. Now, if you saw yesterday's video, you know exactly what we're going to be talking about today. About a week ago, I took delivery of an Audi R8 V10 Plus, and we've spoken about that a bunch, but I only made one video with it. And yesterday, I announced that a new car would be coming to join that car here in London. Now, it feels freezing here in London today, and the car has just been delivered here. This is a roundabout right next to where I live, and the car was literally just driven over we have been handed the keys, as simple as that, and now it's time to show you the car. So ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Gianarelli Design 1. Yeah, well, that's a bit of a shock, isn't it? I don't think... Anyone maybe really expected this? I didn't really expect this. I'll explain how this all uh, came about, but this car is hugely special. I absolutely love this car. It has been delivered here, and we are gonna be driving it around for a couple of months. So this car is owned by Gianarelli, but um, has been lent to me for the next couple of months in order to make videos for you guys, which is awesome. So I'm sorry, I'm trying to also hide because there's a lot of wind, so I don't want you guys to have too much wind noise. But uh, this car is absolutely stunning. So we're going to have this for a couple of months alongside the Audi R8. It was um, a fairly last minute decision, to put all of this together, which is why it's a bit of a surprise. And this is it. I've been following this car since it was first uh, uh, built in uh, Dubai and then shipped over here to come live at my building here in London. So it's come all the way from Dubai for us to be able to enjoy it, and it is beautiful. The spec on this car, as you saw in the montage, is gorgeous. It's this dark blue, sort of grayish color, um, and it's got carbon fiber everywhere. So this front splitter right here, full carbon fiber. The lights, I don't know if you can see in the lights, carbon fiber. All of the painted panels are also carbon. Even here, when you look at these very, um, sort of Ford GT styled air vents there, carbon. Massive gloss carbon weave right there, which is stunning. And then all the way around from these um, little air skirts here that direct the air through the car, carbon side skirts as well. And even when you come all the way to the rear, oh, sorry, we've also even got, in theory, which we probably should have put on, <laughs> some carbon fiber Gianarelli license plates. Let's leave these here. I mean, the car looks absolutely epic. Now, if you guys uh, don't know what this is, it, I, I wouldn't be surprised, because this is actually the first one in the UK. Uh, I'm so, so, so excited, but I've actually already driven one of these back in France a few months ago on the French channel and completely fell in love with it. So here's a clip from that. After having driven that, I just stayed in contact with Generelli because I really, really enjoyed the car. If you're into sort of like hardcore variants of sports cars, this is a bit of you because it weighs only about 800 kilos and it's got over 300 horsepower. So it's got an incredible power to weight ratio and it's also just super, super raw. So the next video, which is gonna be live tomorrow on the channel, is going to be a first drive of this car. Uh, and trust me, it's quite something. The sound it makes is absolutely ridiculous. Um, and the way it drives, you've got no power steering, uh, you have no ABS, so you can lock up the brakes. Um, and overall, it is just an absolute beast. I'm just going around, I'm like, what else can I show you guys? It, you know, obviously it's a, it's a French brand. Um, so we've been working a lot on the French channel. So that's why we're now associating ourselves with this French brand. But uh, I just think it's stunning. I love the circle here, which arcs back to old racing cars. Uh, the little Gianarelli logo as well. I just think it's such a good looking car. It's kind of like a mix of, uh, you know, the, 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 the current design of cars inspired by the past. Some people say that it looks like an E-Type. Some people say it looks like a modern AC Cobra. It's, it's just very pretty, I think, at least. Now, it's fairly niche and rogue the way you get in, but it's very, very cool. So, you're probably wondering, right, where's the door? Because there's no 
hold up here for the door. Now you lift the roof up, which I'm actually gonna hold now because it's quite windy. Come here, you can see all of this exposed carbon fiber right here. And then you've got the interior. Um, so the car, this car, the spec is brown leather with uh, white Gianarelli finishes and then carbon fiber all up on the dashboard right here. Um, it's also got an exposed open gate, or open gate, yeah, basically open and exposed gearbox. Uh, and it is, it is um, pretty intense. So we'll show you in the next video exactly how you get into this car, how you strap yourself in with the harnesses. Um, but it is, yeah, it is just absolutely stunning. And to have this for the next couple of months and to be able to enjoy this and drive this is gonna be super special because I wanna take this in scenarios where you wouldn't expect it. You know, we're gonna drive it around London in city. We're gonna drive it in the country. You know, maybe eventually take it to the track. I don't know, but we're gonna have a lot of fun with this and I really wanna experience it. And because it is the first car here in the UK, I'm hugely excited because I feel like we can, we can show you guys uh, this car and allow you to get to know it. Um, so this, alongside the R8, feels pretty perfect because the R8 is the perfect sort of everyday cruiser which you can use and then this is an awesome weekend car. So uh, yeah, but just being able to have the key and drive uh, when you feel like it. Two cars feel surreal. So thank you guys all so much because obviously it's thanks to you guys that companies like Janet Reddy um, will, will trust us with these cars. So. It is just awesome. Massive thank you, of course, to Jan and Riley. The cars they make are really, really cool. Um, obviously, today, you're only going to see the design, but in the next video, you'll get a little bit of a glimpse into what it's like to drive. And trust me, that's what it's all about with this car. Even though it does look good, the driving is just on another level. So, little surprise. You like it, Cole? I love it. Cole's literally dressed like an Eskimo right now. It is so cold. I just wanted to make the, the video sort of instantly for you guys. Uh, I just, you know, got a call. Car's gonna be delivered outside your house in a little bit. Uh, came down, car's here. Let's get the camera rolling. And uh, yeah, right now we're actually gonna bring it straight into the car park. It's gonna get cleaned up and stuff like that. And then we're gonna drive it tomorrow. So that's why the video is gonna be one day late. Um, so yeah, awesome guys. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it and we will be seeing you very, very soon. No worries, cheers, thank you. Bye guys.